and gold label. This is one I made it myself. This is not inspired by any looks. Literally, I just made it up myself. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay, guys. So, the first thing I'm going to start with is this e.l.f. foundation. If I'm not directly looking in the camera, it's because I'm looking at my mirror. So sorry, guys. After I finish my um, foundation, I look very light with the light. But anyway, then I'm going to take this. You know what, guys? I'm going to put on the other light. A little bit more orange. There, that's a little better. I'm gonna use that one. I like that one better. The more orangey one. Then I take this. Oh, I forgot to shake it with my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Beige. And I put it under my eye like that. Under this eye. Right here. Right here. Right there. And then on all my blemishes, right here. Now I take this, my Laurie Mercier pencils and powder, and I take this brush right here, and I just dab it on, and put it all over my face. Now I'm gonna take the Gimme Brows by benefit and put this all on my brows so so I guess if the lighting keeps changing I just keep changing it because I don't know why it keeps looking weird anyway next I'm gonna take this is my benefit as well it's the Hoola um bronzer and I'm taking this fluffy brush and I just go Next, I'm doing my Glow Kit Anastasia Beverly Hills highlight. Taking Butterscotch right here in this color. And I'm taking this brush. Okay, guys, here comes the actual part of the look, which is the eyeshadow. So I'm going to be taking this palette first. I'm using two palettes. This is the palette I'm taking first. It's Coastal Sense 88 Color Eyeshadow Palette. So here's what it looks like. And I'm just gonna open it up. Whoa, my god, she gets the color I'm using. I'm using, I'm using this color. And I'm gonna be taking this small little brush and just putting it all over my lid. Nothing special. I got some on my arm. Okay, then once I got enough on that eye, I'm gonna do my other eye. Okay, then once I finish that, I'm gonna put that palette away. And now I'm gonna go into this palette, which is my James Charles palette. Here's what it looks like. And I'm going to take the color Wig. It's called Wig. It's this color right here. This gold color that I use a lot in the that one. That's Wig. And I'm gonna be taking my where is it this brush right here 
And guys, just letting you know that all the brushes I use, they do have um, some other color on it so because I don't clean them. So don't mind that. Now I'm taking that color and putting it in the corner of my eye. Like right here. And just sort of adding some color to it. Okay, then I'm doing my other eye. I'm gonna put this even closer over here. Sorry guys, this is more in your other way, but I need it because no, it's actually it's less in your way actually. So like that guys, and you guys with me. And then I'm gonna be taking the light brown color, which is I think it is punch me. Taking that and putting it underneath my eyelid. Putting it very lightly though. Underneath like right under here. Got a little more pop of color underneath because I felt like it was a little plain. Like that. Guys, now I'm gonna go and take this, which is the N SN Splash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara, and this is a waterproof one. Here is it, what it looks like. So we'll come back to you guys once I'm finished because it takes me a while to do my eyelashes. Okay, guys, I finished that. Now the last. And final step is chapstick. Okay, I just put that on. Okay, so here's, so I finished my look. If you guys enjoyed this makeup look, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below more video ideas if you guys have any. Um, yeah. Subscribe to my Squad Magic.